For the first time, Cheha is receiving a cut in funding from the city of Albany. Fox 31's Jessica Fairley explains why. Every year, Cheha draws in thousands of visitors from inside and outside southwest Georgia. This brings in revenue for Albany, which is why the city has been financially supportive in the past. But now funding is being cut. I was not against giving Cheha, uh, continuing to give Cheha some funds, but I just felt like they had to take the same decreases or decline because of the way the economy is. The entity will receive their $1 million annual funding for 2014. However, moving forward over the next few years, Cheha will see a 3% reduction. That's about $30,000 less each year. The cumulative cut is pretty deep at the end of five years, but that gives us time to look at, at that business model and streamline our operation. Cheha officials plan to venture into other options to bring in money, including adding boat ramps and waterfront camping. Probably open sometime late next year, a very nice RV campground that should bring campers in from, from all over the country. Commissioners say although they reduced the park's funding, they recognize Cheha's contribution to the city. It is a quality of life issue. It's something that, that we must maintain to uh, draw people into this city. So maintaining this uh, particular park is uh, critical to our future development. Park officials say the amount awarded by commissioners will be enough for the park to keep its accreditation. They say limited funds are a challenge, but one they will have to deal with. Jessica Fairley, Fox 31 News.